Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel and if you are new here, welcome. My name is Samantha for those of you who don't know me. Today we are going to be doing a video that I've been wanting to do since my last video that I did mention on there that I will be doing a video to compare the Go Big or Go Home uh, Cabon D Mascara with one of my favorite mascaras, the Better Than Sex Mascara. So this is one of my favorite ones, but I really wanted to compare them and show you guys what's the difference between both. They both work amazing if one works better than the other, etc. you know. So with that being said, let's get started. All right, so first we're gonna start with the Go Big or Go Home mascara. So this mascara is around $23, obviously plus tax, but um, so it's $23. Um, the Better Than Sex mascara is uh, $24. So it's a dollar difference between both. Um, I'll show you guys both side to side. You can see it. So, um, the Cab on D mascara, the Go Big or Go Home, well, her whole line is vegan and 100% cruelty free. Um, and the Too Faced mascara and makeup line is cruelty free. But I do believe and I did read that the mascara itself is vegan and cruelty free. But the whole line, the whole makeup line itself is cruelty free. Um, so yeah, I'm, I really, this is one of the reasons why I love this mascara as well because it was cruelty free and it is also very hard to find a mascara that is good and that works for you and that is also cruelty free and or vegan, you know? So when I tried the Kevon D in my previous video that if you have not seen, I recommend that you go watch that video um, first and then come back to this one. <laughs> but if not, that's fine. You can go back to it later. But yes, you guys can go ahead and go watch that video as well. Um, and it's a review over this mascara. When I got this mascara, I heard a lot of great things about it. And... Um, I made the review and I'm not gonna go over it too much but um, I fell in love with this mascara and um, I really thought like why not compare it to one of the next mascara that is amazing as well um, so I was like I'm gonna compare them and see which one is better than the other um, I do believe this one does feel a little bit heavy. It does feel heavy, actually, not a little bit. It feels heavy. This one feels a little less heavy, um, but it is bigger. Um, this one's more like plasticky kind of material, it feels like. And this one is like metal kind of like. So I don't know. This one does feel very like heavy or compared to this one. So um, I'm going to go ahead and try them. I'm so excited and I really, really, really hope that you guys stay tuned and finish watching till the end. So I'm going to start the um, with the Go Big or Go Home mascara on my left side of my eye and then the Better Than Sex on my right side of the eye. So here we go. And I did not curl my lashes, by the way. I wanted to do a video without nothing so you guys can see. My lashes are already curled, kind of. I don't know if you guys can really see them, but my lashes are kind of curled already. These are my natural lashes. Um, so they're naturally curled, but I wanted to show you guys without curling because when I did the Go Big or Go Home um, video, I did do it with my lashes curled, but I wanted to show you what it looks like without doing anything to your um, eyes so or lashes. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it and go from there. So I usually go about uh, two to three coats on each eye, always with every mascara. 
um, usually if I'm like doing super natural look like I'm just going out like grocery shopping or somewhere where like I don't feel like doing too much then I'll do one coat but other than that I usually always do two to three coats always And I'm just brushing. I have not put the mascara brush back in the tube. So I'm literally just brushing my lashes with the same amount that I had when I took it out of the tube. So that's the first coat. Now I'm going to go to the other side with the Better Than Sex mascara. And show you what the first coat looks like on the right side of the eye with the better than sex mascara. Here we go. And again, this is only one coat with the same amount. Mind you guys, my... Um, lashes are different on both sides of my eyes so like this side is more like my eyelashes kind of go everywhere and then this side my eyelashes kind of go all the same up in the same way this one is a little bit i don't know you can see the difference a little bit okay so that's one coat for each side of the eye Okay, one coat. Now I'm gonna go ahead and go to the next side. And this is the second coat of the mascara. And this is with me just going under the lash, not over it. So just, I'm just going under it. Maybe the last coat I'll do maybe on top. I'm not sure over the, the lash. But for now, I'm just doing from the bottom. I'm going to do a little bit at the bottom. Just to open up that eye. Now I'm going to go ahead and go, again, second coat on the left side of the eye. So, okay, so this is two coats. So 
better than sex, go big or go home. So, okay. So I'm gonna go again, one last coat on each side. And then I'm gonna go ahead and see which one I like better. Okay, go big or go home. Let's coat you guys. So this time I'm gonna go over a little bit at the top. Again, I'm going over at the bottom a bit. Okay. So it's a third coat. Oh my gosh, you guys. Can you guys, are you guys literally seeing this? Like, Dios mio. Oh my gosh like how freaking amazing like okay I'm lift the next side so far i'm loving how both are looking but we'll see I'll probably do a little stress test after this all right third coat guys third coat of the go big i mean i'm sorry <laughs> better than sex mascara And everybody likes the mascara different. So I may feel like one way about it and you guys may feel another way about it. So everybody likes doing the mascara differently. Everybody likes the mascara to look differently. So everybody has different lashes than others. So obviously my lashes are gonna look different than yours. My lashes may look worse than yours. My lashes may look better than yours. I mean, honestly, we don't know. But this is the last coat. And honestly, so far, what I can see is this eye is... The mascara is much darker. So the Better Than Sex Mascara is darker like I don't know obviously my eyes all dirty because I need to clean it out anyways um so overall what do you guys think comment down below which one you guys like most um I feel like they both have two different looks you, you the only the thing that I do see most is that this one I don't know you can see the eyelash more than this one like you have to pay attention but I don't know if it's because my lashes are different on each side of my eye like this one kind of goes everywhere and this one's kind of like really pretty and up there so overall like I really really like both looks but I still think this one's more neat and this one is like more like I feel like more natural if that makes sense they both are voluminous like that's for sure like they both give it volume but I do think that <sighs> this is kind of hard you guys this is kind of hard like I don't know I really like both <laughs> but you can see like can you guys see like how it this one outlines the eye, like. 
It looks like I'm wearing liner on top. And I'm not. Can you guys see that? And this one, it doesn't look like that. Do you see what I'm saying? It looks like I'm wearing like the liquid liner on my lid, but I'm not. And this one doesn't. And that's what I mean when I say this one looks more natural. Because this one looks like I'm like, ooh, you know? But I feel like you can use both for two different occasions or two different makeup looks. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, but they both look so beautiful. Like, I don't know. I'm in trouble, you guys. I don't know what to do. Okay, so what I'm gonna do right now, I'm gonna check it for flakiness. Like, I wanna see which one flakes more. I'm gonna kinda rub them both and see which one flakes more. So like, Okay, kind of okay, and then this one. Don't mind my nails, guys. I have not done my nails. Oh my god, I just realized that right now. That I was like, anyways, I'm so sorry. Don't mind them. So embarrassing. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Don't judge me, guys. Don't judge me. Okay, anyways. I'm kind of going to go crazy right now. Okay. So the only thing... I'm going to bring the camera closer to you guys. Because you guys can see what I'm talking about. Okay. So... This is what is left over on this eye. Okay, that is the flakiness of the mascara, of me rubbing it, right? This is what flakiness it gave on this side. Nada. Maybe like one or two little flakes, but this eye i love the lash i love the look of it this eye i love the look of it too it's just two different types of looks of mascara but i did rub this one and that was it left a lot of flakiness so and i have noticed because i have worn this mascara and i've worn both for like throughout the day and I did notice that this one does leave more flakiness throughout the day. And this one will leave like very little, like here and there, maybe like what I have now. So yes, I have noticed that this one does leave more flakiness than this one, which makes this one better in that sense. So meaning like this one doesn't flake as much and this one does flake more. But they're both really good mascaras. I honestly am not mad at either mascara. I just love both of them. Like, I really can tell you, like, oh, I love one more than the other. But I don't. I really just... Oh, perdón. Excuse me, guys. I need some Hugo. Favorite juice. Oh, hey. Orange and carrot juice. Anyways, back to what I was doing. I honestly love both, and I cannot tell you which one I love more. But what I did notice, they both have two different looks. And um, one has more of that. It outlines the eye. Looks like I'm wearing kind of a bit of liner at the top of my lid. And this one is more like natural. more. But they're both voluminous, which is great they both gave me that volume that i like um but just in different style um just depends what look you're going for but overall i really really love both um like i said everybody likes their eyelashes to look a certain way 
I personally like both looks. Um, I would probably go more with this one for me because it's a more natural look and that's what I usually go for most of the time because I'm lazy and I don't like doing my makeup, guys. <laughs> I love doing my makeup. I just hate like getting started like once i'm doing it like i'm so into it and i'm like ooh yeah yeah ooh you know watch out but once i but to get me to be like oh i want to do my makeup like sometimes i'm like ooh no let's do it and most of the time i'm like oh. but yeah once i'm started like i once i get started it's like forget it like that went out the window sometimes i'll be like Oh yeah, babe, don't worry. I'm not going to take long. And then I do a whole fucking masterpiece on my face. And it's like, whoa, what the fuck? But it's a good and a bad thing. I love and I hate to do my makeup. If that makes sense. If anybody feels me, comment down below. Anyways, overall, I love both. Um, and that's it, you guys. I... I don't know let me know comment down below and let me know how you guys feel about um either or mascara well, i really hope that this video helped you guys choose what mascara you guys want to buy next or if you already have one and then you were between oh which one do i want to buy well i hope this video does help you guys choose what mascara works for you um so yeah this is it for the video you guys i really hope you enjoyed it just as much as i enjoyed making this video for you guys um don't forget to follow me on ig my ig is and i'll put down here uh sammy3 underscore xo if you guys want to follow me and yeah um please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up if you really enjoyed this video and also don't forget to click that notification bell so you get notified when i upload new videos i love you guys so much thank you again so much for watching peace and love